Welcome, I'm Deronda with Foods 101, and today I'm going to show you how to make the famous French's green bean casserole. This is fast and easy to make. It's an excellent vegetable side dish for your Thanksgiving Day table that everyone is absolutely going to love. Now the first ingredient you're going to need is three-fourths of a cup of milk, one-fourth of a teaspoon of fresh cracked pepper, one can of cream of mushroom soup. This is a 10 and a half ounce can. You've got two cans of cut green beans you're going to use and each can is 14.5 ounces. And then of course the star of the show are your French's French fried onions. Now if you're looking for the recipe it's on the back of this container as you can see. The French's green bean casserole. Alright now to get this started we're first going to drain the green beans. Make sure all the liquid is drained from your two cans of green beans. And I've just done this over a bowl to show you how we're draining those green beans, but you can do it over your kitchen sink, whatever you are most comfortable with. And next, I'm going to show you how to make the mushroom sauce. As I set the green beans off to the side, we're going to add our can of our mushroom soup right here into a bowl make sure you get it all out now you're going to add your three-fourths of a cup of milk and your fresh cracked pepper with a whisk we're going to stir this very well together until everything is combined okay now i've also got my oven preheating to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and I've also got a one and a half quart baking dish oiled lightly with olive oil. You can use butter or whatever else you've got on hand, vegetable shortening or canola oil. Now to this we're going to add in our drained green beans and we're going to use a cup and a third of our French's um, onion rings but we're going to add two-thirds right here into our green bean casserole. With a spatula, we're going to lightly just fold all these lovely ingredients together until they're well coated. All right, that looks pretty good. And now for our baking dish, and I've already got one lightly greased, we're going to add the green bean casserole right in here like this and you're going to just spread it out and now on the top we're going to add about three-fourths of our three-fourths of a cup of those fried onions right here and if you want to add more go to it but these are just absolutely just delicious to eat mmm by themselves and now off to the oven for the next 35 minutes my green bean casserole has been baking for about 15 minutes and I'm going to go ahead and cover it with a piece of tin foil to keep the onions from getting any browner and then we'll bake this for another 15 to 20 minutes all right just took our green bean casserole out of the oven and look how scrumptious and delicious that is all bubbly around the edges but what I'm going to do is I'm going to let it cool off a little bit and I'll be back to tell you what it tastes like. Time to give it a try and look how creamy and delicious that is. A perfect Thanksgiving Day side dish or as far as that goes for any time during the year. Here we go. And also if you all are needing other Thanksgiving Day videos on how to make certain foods for Thanksgiving check out my links below in the description box of this food video all right here goes the true test mmm oh yummy mmm absolutely delicious look at those onions mmm gotta get a bite of that mmm absolutely spectacular wishing you a happy thanksgiving leave me a comment give me thumbs up and i'll catch y'all next time